repetitive task in video editing can bore you very easily so today i'm going to show you how you can make preset in adobe premiere pro so that you can use that over and over when you are making repetitive tasks when you are recording the video on your studio then you can use the audio preset every single time so that you don't need to change the audio settings every single time so here on this video i will adjust some colors and then i'll make a preset by the way there is a difference between preset and lat when you are making a lat that settings is baked on this lat right you will not able to change anything on that lat but when you are making a preset you will have options to change the settings whenever you want right so that is the powerful feature of using presets so here on this video i will make some color grading change right so i'll go to color workspace which is this one and then maybe i will add uh, some changes on my color temperature i'll open lumetri scope this one then and i'll see the skin tone maybe so this is the place where every day i record my videos the lighting will not change every day the place will not change every day so the color temperature the light i'm using the microphone i am using will stay the same every single day right and now i will add some blacks here i will add some contrast maybe i will increase the exposure a little bit then decrease the highlights i will add some sharpening right again i will add another lumetri color effect and from here i will select my skin tone maybe i will extend some colors i will add blur i mean feather on my selection and now i will add maybe some orange tone here i'll go to the effects control panel then i'll duplicate this one the second lumetri color effect ctrl c ctrl v it will duplicate the lumetri color again i'll select the third one and from here i will invert the selection right now you can see the selection have been applied on the background and here i will reset the color and i will add some bluish tone here on the background so yes it is looking great right so here you can see there are three different lumetri color effect on this video right but if you're making LUTs, you cannot use three different lumetri color instance so in that kind of scenario you need to make preset how you can make preset it is very simple you need to select select one then press ctrl on your keyboard or command on your keyboard then select another one then another one three lumetri color have been selected now right click and then click on save preset name it whatever you want i will name it premiere pro class then if i click ok it have been saved on my fx panel so i need to go to fx panel i will go to essential graphics workspace and from here if i go to fx panel i can go to here which is preset click here then you will see premiere pro class this one right so first let's remove the color effect that we have been applied right i'll go to fx control panel then i will delete the lumetri color this one this one this one so this is the base video that i have shoot on my camera right and if i want to color grade it again and again i don't need to change the colors from lumetri color panel every single day what i can do i have to go to fx control panel this one if you don't see go to window then enable fx then this panel will appear go to preset and from here you can see the preset just we made is there right you have to just click and drag this preset on your video then the color will be applied here on this video now if you want to change any settings from the colors then if you go to effects control panel you'll see three different lumetri color that we have made earlier and you will have all the flexibility to change the colors from here so that is the simple thing that is the simplest way to use color grading preset or any kind of preset again and again on your project and it will save a lot of time when you are working with adobe premiere pro so that is all for today i hope you have liked this video if you have liked this video and learned something new from this one then you can give me a thumbs up and if you know this channel want to learn adobe premiere pro or video editing then you can subscribe to this channel to get more videos just like this one I'll catch you guys on the next one. Until then, goodbye.